हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी विल रीड चैप्टर फाइव इन इंग्लिश द केक थी सो लिसन दिस वीडियो केयरफुली एंड देन रीड द चैप्टर द केक थी इट वॉज अर्ली इन द मॉर्निंग द पीपल ऑफ द हाउस हैड नॉट येट वोकन अप मिटी माउस सेट टू हिज मदर मामा दीज पीपल आर सो काइंड They leave such nice things in the kitchen for us to eat. With a twinkle in her eye, Mama Mouse said, "Well, I don't think they like us, Mitty. You are not to look about in the house alone. You think they are kind, but they may still try to catch you." Mitty didn't agree at all. He was quite sure he could take care of himself. Soon, Mama Mouse curled herself up for her afternoon nap. Mitty scampered into the kitchen, and there on the kitchen table was the most wonderful thing—a large cake with beautiful pink and white icing. Mitty licked his lips as he sniffed it. I must taste this, and he started nibbling it. He didn't know he was nibbling away at little Miss Bluebell's birthday cake. Then he heard a sound. Oh dear, that's Mama waking up. Off he ran and was back in the hole again. Mama Mouse sat rubbing her eyes. Time for some food, Mitty. Let's go, she said. So Mitty and Mama scampered into the kitchen. When she saw the hole in the cake, she was annoyed. Some other mouse has been there before us, she said. She never guessed that it was her own little son. The next morning, Mitty popped into the kitchen again when his mother was asleep. At first, he could find nothing to eat but there was a delicious smell of cheese he looked around and found a small wooden house in a corner on the floor and there hung the cheese just inside it in ran mitty and click went the wooden house mitty was caught in a trap a little later A woman came into the kitchen. She called a pretty little girl to come and see the thief who had eaten her cake. "What are you going to do with him, Mummy?" asked Bluebell. "Why, feed him to Kitty, of course," her mother said. Bluebell's kind heart melted when she saw the tiny mouse. "You didn't know it was stealing, did you, little mouse?" She asked Mitty. "No," squeaked Mitty sadly. As soon as her mother's back was turned, kind-hearted Bluebell opened the door of the trap. Mitty rushed out. Mitty ran home to his mother as fast as he could. She comforted him and he felt safe again. He promised never to disobey her again. and you can be sure he never did